and this followed the signing of that term sheet between Zesco and uh, and KCN. Uh, what was even worse was that this declaration of common carrier was followed by a setting of an interim, of the so-called interim tariff, by the regulator. And in CC's view, this interim tariff was assessed to be 30% of our standard uh, tariff. So obviously, that was a big issue. Uh, from a company perspective, we saw that as infringing on our property and commercial uh, commercial rights. We did engage uh, government in trying to resolve this matter. Unfortunately, that did not yield much progress. In the end, following advice from our legal experts, we sought a judicial review. I have to report that as a company, we are, we are very pleased that on 26 February, the High Court delivered ruling in favor of CEC, quashing both the decision of the minister and uh, the regulator. Uh, we are aware that the government uh, did not like this, obviously. They did appeal the decision of the High Court, and at the same time, they sought to stay uh, this decision of the High Court. Uh, I have to report here that uh, the stay that the government was seeking failed, uh, fortunately, for the business. Uh, in as far as the appeal is concerned, uh, these are matters that we expect will be coming up in the next uh, few months. So as a company, uh, we remain committed to resolve uh, this issue. We think uh, the best position for the parties is to use this opportunity uh, to try and uh, finalize the contracts and uh, uh, focus on stabilizing uh, the, the power sector. So we'll continue to seek those opportunities uh, to engage.